We've talked about hopefulness for us, but what does it look like for your friends to be hopeful? I'm James. And I'm John. And we're from Schools Ministry Group Life Matters. Today we want to investigate what other people could be hopeful for in your life, your friends and your family. And this week we've been talking about hope and our Kotawaza, the wise saying, a hopeful heart makes many things possible. Mm. And we think so many things are possible in the future, so many wonderful things for you. But we want you to think today about the people around you and what they could be hopeful for. Right, we've talked about what we can be hopeful for, and we've done some really cool activities about reminding us to be hopeful, but we can also think about what people around us are hopeful for. And as James said, we can think about our friends, we can think about our family, our teachers, or our principal. So we're going to get you to do a little bit of investigating today about what others are hopeful for. So James, what are you going to do to investigate? Well, I think I might go to my family, and I'm going to take my iPad, and I'm going to go and interview my mum, my dad, maybe my sister, around what they are hopeful for. I'm going to say, hey sister, her name is Alex, hey Alex, what are you hopeful for? What could you think about in the future that is going to be really great and really wonderful? And I'm going to make a little video, and then I'm going to splice it all together, and we're going to have a little video of all the people in my family and what they're hopeful for. So it sounds like you're going to be a bit of a an investigator, almost bit a, a bit journalist. of a bit of a detective. Yeah. Well, well, I'm going to be a bit of an investigator, a private investigator, and I'm going to have my notepad and my pencil, and I'm going to go and ask my friends. I've got four of them, what they're hopeful for. So hopefully they've been listening in the lessons as well, and I'm going to ask them, hey, four friends. What are you most hopeful for at the moment? And I'm going to write it all down and make a nice list of all the things that we're hopeful for as friends. That sounds great. That's going to be a lot of friends for you to tackle, and I hope that you can get through all of that at once. We're so thankful that you joined us this week to talk about hope, and I think that you can investigate so many people and what they're hopeful for, because we know that a hopeful heart makes many things possible, and we think your school communities and your families will benefit from we hope to see you next week. We're going to be talking about brave and all things to do with brave feelings. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for riding along with us as, as we've looked into hopefulness. And we look forward to seeing you next week for Bravery Week. See you then, James. See you, John.